My background is a writer-producer, and how I got into this distribution game and how I learned the game was by all of my failures on my first film. I learned the game of each of the markets, from theatrical to VOD to online. Just over a couple of years of helping colleagues get distribution for their films in as little as four months. Eventually, some of these colleagues convinced me I really should share it. Because distribution has become a little more democratic, back in the 70s, 80s, up to a certain point in the 90s, you made a movie, the studios bought it, you didn't have to do anything, off it went into the marketplace. Nowadays, because so many more films are being made, filmmakers have so much more opportunity to just get a camera and shoot their own movie. It is really a necessity that filmmakers learn about distribution. Now, one of the things, if you haven't made your movie yet, Look at who your audience is. Not, oh, I'm making a genre film, so people who like horror films is my audience. Well, yeah, that's a big percentage of the country. But who is your audience within that genre film? If you can understand who your audience is, you can actually do things in the screenplay, in the script writing stage, to help gear your material either to that audience or if you don't want to go that far, at least having things in your film that that audience would like or appreciate. i use an example. This might be a little contrived, but let's say you're making a genre film and the lead character or the villain drives a 66 Mustang. If that 66 Mustang becomes an integral part of the story in some way, then you know what? You now may have an audience of Mustang lovers who also like genre films, that would be interested to see this film because you've got a 66 Mustang in it. And it will help the independent producer. I have potentially this audience, three or four different audiences, and that can really help the film be targeted and marketed to those audiences when it's done. Torture porn is, I don't know if anybody's ever talked about it this way, but to me, torture porn is a segment within the horror genre. Gay films, lesbian films, that's a niche market. That's not a market within a market necessarily, but then you could have a market within that market. Let's say within the gay audience, you have a film about a transgendered person, okay? And transgender is considered, I think by many, to be part of that audience. It's not, you know, if somebody likes a gay or lesbian film, but they may not care so much for transgender, well, if you've made a transgendered film, you're gonna lose some of the gay lesbian audience, but transgender is even more niche than gay lesbian. So if you've got that, you're gonna really target your transgender audience or the people who like films about that. And that is a very, you know, definite niche. 